Hello everyone, I'm coming to you today with uh, an urgent request I've talked about a few times and uh, I come to you this time because we are just up against the clock. Got just about a few days left that uh, I've been talking about the orphanage a lot and have asked you for help several times and uh, a few of you have helped and I appreciate the help that came through. Uh, but this time I'm asking that if you're watching this video that you will really uh, give, that you'll really donate that you'll click the donate button actually give something a dollar five dollars twenty dollars a hundred dollars a thousand dollars whatever anything's important because right now we don't have enough and we need it so i'm going to share with you a couple quick pieces of video that will help you understand one from joe free he's my spiritual son and who is the director of the orphanage in kenya it's in kisi kenya citadel orphanage center and we have just about um, eight days to have the entire job completed uh, we have uh, three days to come up with the rest of the money and supplies to build the project in time to have it done. Or Joe will go to prison for five years. Five years, my friends. Uh, a great young man, passionate for Christ, making a difference in the world. His parents were beheaded. He now runs the orphanage. He's sharing Jesus with kids. He is helping them to have food, education, uh, everything they could, could possibly need and hope for and they've lost their parents to ridiculous situations uh, and they're looking for homes and he's taking care of them in the meantime so all this is over a toilet a latrine um, it's a corrupt system over there and there's a lot of stories i could share with you uh, but he was in prison i had to raise money to get him out of prison uh, for about 30 days cost 400 dollars to get him out and now about 700 to complete the project to get this latrine done for boys and girls at the orphanage or everything's done he goes to jail his wife leaves the children get displaced go back on the streets and um and it ends can't happen need your help dig in deep this time if you're an american uh, your your money is a not as a tax deductible uh, gift as you give to our uh, nonprofit organization uh, if you're not american just give if you want to. I mean, I know you don't have to have a tax right off to give, right? But uh, if somebody needs it, it's available. All right, so that link will be in this video. Please give. We need more food. Chicken. Praise the Lord, Pastor Marty. I'm very humbled and appreciate so much your great support to the Kenya Study of Fund Center. Uh, being the director of the orphanage for sure, this month and last month, it has been a month of it has been this it's it has been a month of challenges and we're trusting lord that god is going to open ways god is really working on us i was arrested for 30 days and because that our last train was in very bad condition the health officers had to arrest me for that and I was arrested and jailed for 30 days and I was given another 30 day, days to co to complete a new latrine which I have already dug and for sure we lack the materials to peel it. We are running out of days, we are I'm now remain with 8 days to go. I'm worried what to do right now because I have no any money, uh, money to build the latrine or to buy the materials, yet I'm struggling to get food for the kids. Things are not really working well, but I'm praying and trusting Lord that things are going to work better. It's my prayer and the request that post support do us, it will really help us and it can keep this ministry going. Because I'm worried, I have been, I have been thinking of going to hide. 
but my spiritual father told me my son don't, don't worry things are going to work out we are just praying and trusting lord that these things will work will work out very well and now i'm trusting lord before this day ends we get some materials in the latrine will be done in less than three days it's my prayer i'm i'm really humbled for this Thanks for everyone who will be able to support us. You are very much welcome. Thanks.